share some ex stories. What if I told you I don't have any exes? I don't consider any of the people I had things with exes at all. Sarah Burr, thank you very much for the roses. I'm Sarah Bear, Jesus Christ, I'm bad at this thing. Young Milf, thank you very much for the roses. Is there two Young Milfs in the chat now? Do you have two people with the same name? Camilla, thank you for the roses. Lacey, thank you for the roses. Uh, Lachalan, thank you for the roses. I appreciate the love. Jeanette, thank you so much. No, it's me. Okay, you changed the profile picture, right? I was like, I was like, I swear to fucking God it. Or maybe I'm just stupid. A little bit of both, probably. Chuck, thank you so much. Peter, I appreciate it. Who sent me the lights, though? Lex, Lexi R, thank you for the lights. I appreciate the lights a lot. <laughs> There's MILFs everywhere. That's why they're on TikTok and not at work. Listen. That's something I'm okay with. They can run businesses. They can run whatever they want. MILFs and MILFs can be the future of everything. It's fine. It's fine by me. They're allowed to do what they want. Thank you very much for the lights again. Oh, who sent the lights? Chuck sent the lights. Thank you so much, Chuck. Bay, Peter Porter. Thank you for the love. D, thank you for the finger hearts. Dang, Ellie, Beto. Jesus Christ. Appreciate it all. Thank you so much. Have you listened to Ice Spice yet? I have not. I have not. Jake, you seem like such a nice guy, very humble. I appreciate that. I'm glad I gave up that impression. Um, I don't know. I'm, I feel like I'm nice. Yeah, I'm nice. I don't know if I'm humble, though. I don't know if I'm very humble. Olivia, thank you for the roses. Blossom, thank you for the roses. Chuck, thank you for the weights. Why did you not go live last Friday and Saturday? Saturday, there was a birthday party for my dad, like we get together. So I was busy. Friday, I was probably, I don't know what the fuck I was doing. I was out fucking or something. Who knows? Um, I was just busy, I guess. Where's my little, my little foot rest here? Foot rest. Like, I don't know what I was doing. I honestly can't remember. Either I wasn't in the mood, my phone was dead, I was out doing something. Wasn't in the mood. Doing other work. I don't know. There's probably there's probably no good reason, honestly. There's probably no good reason. Thank you for all the follows. I appreciate the love. Jeanette, Anita, L Little Lena, Nelly, Peter Porter. Thank you for the love. Where is your doggy? Um, I don't know. There's three of them, and they're probably scattered throughout the house. I couldn't tell you. I honestly couldn't tell you. Do you ever go on road trips? Not recently, but when I was young, for like family vacations, I went on tons of road trips. Tons of road trips, and in the winter, and in the winter when it like when I go to the mountains to snowboard, um, lots of road trips for that. Quite a bit of driving, but other than that, like. Not really. Do you smoke cigarettes? No. No, not at all. Charlie and Nelly, thank you for the love. I need to show you these Dash Hound corn dog stickers. I would love to see that. I fucking love corn and I love Dash Hound, so hey, you can definitely do that. My phone is falling over here. How do I fix this? We look alike. I don't believe you. I don't believe you for a second. Have you said hello to Brazil today? I can't remember. What's your favorite color? Orange. I love the color orange. I love the color orange.
JD, thank you for the roses. Sonia and Nito, thank you for the love. Okay, guys. Corn and corn dogs are very different things. No, because you need don't you need corn to make corn milk or or not? Am I am I mistaken? Chloe says you can't remember shit. I got a lot of things to remember, you know. I got a lot of things to remember. He's definitely tired, guys. I've been. I honestly didn't even get fucking sleep last night. You're correct. I think. Yeah. I don't know. Do you need corn to make like corn milk? Cornbread is one of my favorite things. I love cornbread too. Cornbread is fucking delicious. Nelly and Josie, thank you for the love. You look alike or he stole your pick. What am I looking at, guys? Um, Julia says, do you ever feel like no one really truly knows you? And if you dropped the veil, they would might not like you? I don't know. Um, it's hard to tell, like, if anyone really likes me, but I have, I have friends, I have family, I have whatever, and I don't really have a, a veil, um, so there's nothing to be dropped, so, like, I'm, I'm pretty much, like, the thing is, is, like, I do have people that don't like me, due to the fact that I am myself pretty much 100% of the time, so, so with being yourself, obviously, you aren't scared to, ste like, step on toes, so you're gonna have people that don't like you regardless, um, but yeah, as far as like, like, am I scared people aren't gonna like me for being me? No, not at all. That would be, that would be the silliest thing. That would be the silliest fucking thing. Sharon, thank you for the hearts. Alexis, do you even care about that? It depends on the person, because like, obviously I like, my parents, I want them to like think, like, I want them to like, cause they, they had a part in raising me and stuff, right? So obviously I want them to be like pretty satisfied with who I am. I let them know I'm very happy with what I do and who I am um, and things like that. But but like for the majority of people, like strangers, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. But when it comes to people like family and whatnot, um, yeah, I would, I would like them to enjoy who I am, obviously. And it's more so like, it's not for me, it's more so for them, right? It's more so for them. Because like, if they don't like who you are, even if it is like just based around their morals or just whatever it may be, um, the, the, the parents can think all like, "Oh, have I failed as a parent? What did I do wrong? Could I have done things differently?" Like, there's so many different things that could be thought on their end, right? It's not so much for me at that point. V, thank you for the roses. Nata Natasha Janae, thank you very much for the roses. Megatrons, this is the first time I heard you speak. Your energy is out of this world. Beautiful. Listen, let's not get carried away. I wouldn't say it's out of this world. I'm a very average guy, but I do appreciate it. I'm glad you enjoy my personality. Victoria, thank you very much for the floral. I appreciate it. Nelly, thank you very much for the weights. Were you raised with any religion? I was raised Roman Catholic, but no one's really religious in my family. HX, Fatso, and Nelly, thank you for the love. Thank you for the love. 